And speaking of the Biden administration, uh, it is planning to ban the Russian-made Kaspersky antivirus software. The Commerce Department says that Russia's influence over the company poses a significant security risk. NTD Shar Marshall has more. The Biden administration is banning U.S. companies and citizens from using Kaspersky, a Russian antivirus software. It's an unprecedented step. The Commerce Department said it's out of national security concerns. The department says a Moscow's influence over the company poses a significant risk. Or one of the things that people don't understand is that antivirus software scans your entire computer in order to root out infections and bugs. So if you have a malicious piece of antivirus software on your computer, it can potentially get access to your files and other personal items such as passwords, addresses, anything that would lead a cyber criminal to assume someone's identity. Cybersecurity firm Kaspersky is denying that it's a security threat. And the Kremlin said that a U.S. decision to ban Kaspersky software was a typical move by Washington to damage a company that competes with American ones. Meanwhile, the Commerce Department argues Russia has shown it has the capacity and the intent to exploit Russian companies like Kaspersky to collect and weaponize the personal information of Americans. The other thing that's interesting about antivirus software most Windows and Macintosh computers already have antivirus software built in, so there really isn't a need for any of the third-party programs that you would install on your computers. Commerce Secretary Raimondo said, I would encourage you in the strongest possible terms to immediately stop using that software and switch to an alternative in order to protect yourself, your data, and your family. Sean Marshall, NTD News.